Hi, and welcome back to Two Minutes with the VA. Our next question is from Bonnie. And Bonnie says that her client's having her print a ton of brochures. Uh, she thinks she should charge for supplies, but she's not sure. She wants to know if there's a general rule of thumb. Um, Bonnie, I know that there is a, a, a manual out there that probably will tell you what to charge. Um, if it's a ton of brochures, though, I really think you're probably going to do better printing them at... Um, like uh, overnightprints.com, they have really good prices and they're really quick. Um, also, you can check like at your local FedEx office type thing. Uh, what's it? it used to be Kinko's, but now I think it's FedEx office. I can't remember. Um, but you might want to check with them. The cool thing with FedEx that I really like and their Kinko's um, is that they have a print to thing, so I can actually like print something and then I can print it to their office and go pick it up. It's really cool. Um, it's like a print driver or something. I think they're still doing that. I'll look and see and I'll put a link to it if so. Um, but yeah, you know, if you're doing a lot of printing enough that, you know, you're thinking you want to charge for supplies, there's either two things going on. Either A, you're not charging enough per hour, or B, you're doing too big of a job at your home office. Um, if you have some, like, some professional brochure printing uh, equipment at your office, then you really do need to come up with a price. You know, find out what all the other guys are charging and figure out if you can, you know, meet that or or, you know, do something similar. Um, but, you know, if you're worried about, you know, printing out 20 pages for a client, then you're probably not charging enough, to be honest with you. So you need to look at your hourly rate and things like that. It's kind of like charging for postage, right? I mean, if I mail something to my client, it costs me two bucks, I'm not going to bother. You know, but if I'm doing like some big mailing or something that's, you know, going to be $50 in postage, that's a whole other, you know, uh, ball of wax. Uh, but I would tell you, you know, that that's what I would tell you to do is, don't print it yourself if it's so many that you're that worried about it. All right. Thanks and have a great day, Bonnie.